Today we're going to have a look at the HM46B milling machine. Now it's very similar to the RF31 and the HM32, but with a big difference. This comes with a six-speed 95 to 1650 RPM gear-driven head, and it's powered by a 240 volt, two horsepower motor. And the three axes come with dovetail slides for improved accuracy. And it's supplied with a 3MT spindle and a 75 mil diameter quill. Now this machine is shown on its optional stand and can be used in such areas as engineering, maintenance workshop, automotive workshops, farming equipment, and the serious hobbyists. Now let's run through the many features of this machine. This machine features a large 730 mm by 210 mm groundwork table with T-slots. The Extraverse is 485 mm and comes with adjustable stops. The Y-axis is 175 mm and Z-axis is 430 mm. It also has the option to add a power feed to the longitudinal X-axis. The hand wheels have a nice and easy movement with metric dial graduations of 0.05 mm for X and Y axis, plus a wind up head. And it features precision ground slides for X, Y and Z movements. And it comes with locking clamps on all axes and rear slideway covers to protect against swarf. Now this is an excellent feature, have a look at it. It's the digital readout system and it comes with the X and Y axis as standard and the Z axis you can buy at your leisure. The three axis readout can be adjusted to suit the operator's needs. And the functions of this three axis digital readout system is that you can have bolt hole circle, bolt hole line, as well as metric and imperial measurements. Now let me show you the control panel because I've already turned the power on. This is forward and that's stop. This is reverse, and that's stop. But if you also have two safety features, when you're in forward, hit that immediate stop. And then there's a second safety feature as well. When it's going, if this comes out, automatic stop again, genius. So moving onto these controls, you've got a six speed spindle gearbox. Coming up here, you've got high and low, two, three, one, an effective quill depth of 120 millimeters, Coming around, you can control your quill depth here, but then if you want to, you can even go finer. We'll tighten that, and then you can fine tune it to a graduation of 0.025. And when you found the depth you want, you just lock it off. Just perfect. Now what's another great feature? The gear-driven head can be tilted up to 90 degrees either side of center, and all you have to do is loosen three bolts. So this will allow you to do a whole lot of milling and slotting and boring and grooving and drilling operations. So this unit comes with everything that you see here, including the toolbox, the facing cutter, the drill chuck, the sleeve, the arbor, the oil can and the drifts and everything else. Now, if you're doing something that's really heavy duty and you need coolant, the unit is already pre-built with the coolant fitting. So the coolant pump is optional, but the fittings are already standard. Now taking into account the weight of the machine, this is a heavy duty steel stand. Now it's optional, but it's heavy duty. So if you want one of those, just let us know. Now we're gonna show you just how easy it is to change the milling cutter to the drill chuck. Firstly, you just loosen the draw bar on the top, give a light tap, remove the cutter, install your drill chuck, and then tighten the draw bar again. So there you have it, great machine, great features. And to find out more or just order yours, go to the Machinery House website.